tell us in the comments. Don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with everyone you know. Has been uh, in the arts and culture scene in Manila and in some parts of the world for some time now. But when the pandemic began, he became one of the early adapters in uh, creating his own niche in the digital space. The more I've spent time with myself, the more I sort of like gotten to know and be comfortable in my own skin. So I know you as an actor and, and you know, we've seen each other in parties and in the social circle for quite some time now, although I'm no longer in that scene. But, you know, having seen you in a different light, I told myself, you know what, I, I, I'm, I think I'm going to dedicate one episode just to find out, just to get to know you more. And, you know, and at the same time, since my show is about arts and culture and the lifestyle scene in Metro Manila, I think my audience will be very interested to know more about you. And I'd like them to follow your show as well, not just here in the Philippines, but yeah, as you know, we broadcast in other countries as well because uh, friends out there, you know, Jake hosts a daily, like a Monday to Friday live stream. It was not moan. It wasn't only about the show for me. It was the experience of 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 integrating in new culture yeah. and then a different language and Europe. Yes, of course. <laughs> it's very simple. It's, it's, it's yes, Europe. yes. But you know, I, I never forget those times because that was also the time when. I started to really uh, get, you know, really get close to my family, and and I started looking at working with independent films, with and working with young students who are who are studying or making their thesis in La Salle, and I said it's very hard for me to get into mainstream. Um, I w I wasn't really really half confident in saying that I want to be in films because you know when you say you want to be in films what do you want to be do you want to be just a doctor or do you want to be a leading man or a character actor I mean the comparison I couldn't it's a very clickish group in a way because most film actors are come from networks like GMA and ABS-CBN and if you don't belong there you don't have the, the endorsements and uh, and people won't recognize you really so I started to like enjoy this work or this word called independent or indie actor and there yeah. was Cinemalaya and there was you know all these in, independent young minds who want to who have passion to create films and i was slowly building up my confidence in building an acting reel uh, an acting reel to to audition or to 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 show to people that oh i can act if you pay attention <laughs> I say this with with much pride because i knew when i was engaging myself or my time with cinemalaya i knew that you didn't have to be that or you don't have to be a blockbuster actor to, to to be in a film and i love that it gave me uh an, as an independent actor to say oh i can do this i know filmmaking i, I understand it I, I love the camera so that confidence propelled me to audition for a visiting British director and it was uh, it, Celine Lopez just rang me and said oh would you like to have dinner with 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 this director Naka, na ano daw na, na may na nominate those academy uh, in yeah. uh, the Oscars for a short film and I said you know it could be like anybody right you don't really expect like but, I said you know you're not just passively waiting for opportunities to open you 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 don't you do other things as you are involved in current projects that will make your network bigger and, you know, uh, creating communities in, within your sphere of influence, yeah. whether it's among actors or among film directors or among, you know, uh, uh, marketing people like myself. Or, I think that's the important thing is that our community of creative professionals are getting, I would say, we're, we're getting a better voice out there. Uh, thank God for for live streaming or the internet because we we can now establish our own little piece yeah. of real brand ourselves, 
and create that um, you know that that you can be you can be, bring value to the table. Yeah, I think because also because we've aged. <laughs> let, let me just point that out because yes, it, the time has come when you know you don't think that oh you you, you don't want to wait. This is the time when you can actually highlight people that's why i'm always cheering on actors when there's filipino actors my first priority will be theater actors jake i know that this project of yours has been uh, making you wake up with a bright spring in your step and new energy and i think that you are um, you're you're blooming my friend i, I you know this <laughs> has opened up new avenues joy into your life Stay tuned for the next episode Only here on Z81 Radio Manila